Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back. We got Radiohead Creep today. The reason why we're doing Radiohead and Creep is because uh, one of our subscribers that has commented on almost every video I think that we've done, Mike, Thank you so much for always supporting us. Yes. Um, you had mentioned postmodern jukebox, mm -hmm. and so we're looking at doing that. And you mentioned, I think, the song "Creep" as well, but we didn't actually know the original song "Creep" by yes. Radiohead. We haven't heard this before. So before we got into that, we wanted to make sure we had an idea about the original, right? Yeah. And you don't know much about Radiohead, right? I don't really know anything about them. Me neither. So that makes two of us. <laughs> So Radiohead, as far as we do know, is from the 90s. Uh, they got their start around the 90s, uh, an English band, yeah. right? Yeah, I think there's um, five of them. Yeah, and I think they're a rock band, if you know we're, we're correct on yeah, that one. Yeah, I believe two of them are brothers. Yeah, great. that's right. Yeah. So so that's kind of what, what we know about Radiohead. Yeah. I do rem recognize the name. I think maybe it was on a couple of like mix CDs when I was growing mm -hmm. up. Okay. Of maybe some later hits that they had. But this is, I think, their first mainstream hit that they had was Creep. So cool. um, be interesting to see where their stand sound started from. And yeah. then we can check the postmodern jukebox after that. So awesome. you ready to check out Radiohead? Yes. Let's do it. All right. As usual, make sure you like and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Let's get it. sucked into it drawn into it i really enjoy this song it's it's uh it's it's got everything uh, you know all mixed together it seems in a uh, great variety uh, in the mix of you know his vocal sounds mm -hmm. great he's got a strong range as well yeah he does the nice soft tones in the beginning yeah. and then 
moving on to a little bit harder yeah, sound. Yeah, build but, it up a little bit. But you know, not in a, when he, even when he goes into the you know more aggressive tone, it's still you know very ear pleasing with his vocal in itself. Yeah, I think the instrumentation though too like adds to that. Like I mean, I think that the instrumentation is very. I don't. It's definitely not soft, but it's just like very ear pleasing as well, and I feel like it complements his voice nicely. Yeah, I feel like this is kind of maybe getting into that grunge sound a yeah. little bit um, that got into the nineties. Grunge band. <laughs> yeah, um, there's there's a lot that were super super popular around that time period so given this is like early 90s i wonder if that's maybe leading in with that sound or maybe what yeah, that's what maybe. radiohead does sound like a little bit but i i i do like it in that you know the strong bass line in the beginning of really setting the tone mm -hmm. for everything um but even in the mix like the the cymbal um you know the way they're using the drums yeah really, i really like the drums it yeah. sits in really well yeah. and the use of the guitars the electric yeah. guitars in there um and you know just in general like i said i think the way it kind of builds up into this you know f full throttle energy portion yeah. aligned with some of the lyrics yeah i, I think it's definitely it's, built up throughout the song yeah sure. i think it's just comprised really really well i do i do enjoy it and like i said it it sounds nice but it still keeps you really engaged with some energy and mm -hmm. that's that's an interesting mix because you don't always get yeah. that but i'm finding that the more we listen to some rock songs, they do a great job. A lot of these, you know, more well-known bands, they do a great job of mixing and matching that energy portion with some some lulls, some breaks, and bringing yeah, back the energy. Yeah, 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 right? which kind of like draws you in more. Yeah. Yeah. So you like this? Or I do like it. Yeah. Um, I really enjoy the instrumentation of it. Like you said, I think the guitars sound great. I think the drums sound great. I think it fits very well together, and I think all of that complements his voice very well too. So yeah. the entire like vibe of the song, I feel like it flows really well. Yeah, I, I do enjoy the sound. You know, I, I think you can hit, hear a little bit of his accent in yeah. there. Not a whole lot, but you can hear it just <laughs> a little, slightly. A little tinge. <laughs> Whatever you want You're so fucking special I wish I was special But I'm a creep I'm a widow What the hell am I doing here? I didn't. I didn't notice uh, the piano in any other portion of it. Did you? I didn't pick it out. No. So maybe they just added, added that in at the end to add a little more yeah. dramatic feel to like it. But. A little outro. Yeah, but I enjoyed that overall. I thought it was really good. I thought it was well done. I'd like to hear a little bit more from them. I feel like, like I said, it's they've got that you know early '90s sound. Yeah, I was gonna say. I feel like this is very different in terms of sound than anything else that we've really done thus far. In yeah, terms of I would agree. Um, oh, maybe a little bit of Pearl Jam sound in there. Yeah. Um, from that one song that we did, um, yeah. Black, but not a ton. But no, I, I feel I like could... it's unique though. Like you said, like maybe it's to the time period, and we yeah. haven't really gotten into much from this time period yet. But I liked it. Yeah, no, I agree. It was it was different, but enjoyable at the same time. Well, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed our reaction. If you did, you know what to do. Hit that like button for us. Leave us a comment. Let us know what your thoughts are. Give us some recommendations. That's how we learn. Tell us about Radiohead. Tell us about Creep. Tell us anything else we should know. Yes. And uh, we'll be dropping stuff. <laughs> In the future, that's for sure. So you got to come back and check that out. Thanks for watching, guys, and we'll see you in the next one.